So are you right-handed or are you left-handed? And did you know animals can be right or left-handed as well? Recently, some researchers were studying blue whales. Notice 90% of them are right-handed. Or I guess right-finned, if you want to be technical. The right-finned blue whales would more likely turn right in schools of krill, which is what they feed on, then turning left to feed on the krill. When the krill was closer to the surface of the water, they would turn left to use their more dominant eye, their left eye. When you're right-handed, your left eye is more dominant. When you're left-handed, your right eye is more dominant. That's what clued the researchers in to knowing that blue whales are more right finned dominant. These same sorts of studies have been done and noticed that kangaroos and horses are more likely to be left-handed or left pod and hooved. Surprisingly, dogs, cats, and octopus, or octopi if you feel the need, are right down the middle, almost 50-50 depending on left or right-handed, or pod or tentacled. Oh, this is getting confusing! If you want to try this at home, just call your cat or dog, or give them a little treat and see which foot they take their first step with. If it's the right paw, more than likely it's going to be right-handed. The left paw, then she might be left-handed. So now, when somebody asks you, hey, what's on your mind? You can finally give them a good answer. 90% of blue whales are right-handed. Or even ask them, is it considered still right-handed or is it right-finned? Should there be a general term for all animals as right paw? Hmm, the questions just keep going. For all my science, I'm Melissa Miller.